Welcome back to Escape from Mars. Last time, I promised you a chill building session, but that was not entirely true. So this time, I'm going to make good on my word. Most of us aren't in the game yet, so we'll start with a quick time lapse of RCX building alone. Yeah, so I was thinking this time, uh, what we should do. Uh, I was going to build a little, uh, like, enclosure on the roof of the... Um, the big rover that Rev's um, flying thing can go in because we won't want to be flying that all the time. Do you, well, you don't want an enclosure, don't? Well, of what you mean with protection from guns from above? Uh, that's exactly what I mean. Yes. Yeah, you just want a landing spot, but yeah. Well, um, a landing spot with a roof. That that's a hangar. Well, oh, oh, okay. You do mean with a with a roof? Okay. Well, yeah. Unless you want to get shot from above. Well, um, I do have. I'm just putting a second gatling on top of it now, but maybe right. But hmm. that doesn't stop you. That doesn't stop the incoming fire. Yeah. Well. Well. well in fact, it invites the incoming fire. One might say. Indeed, it does. Oh, it's night time. Before I just start dicking around constructing a vehicle to replace the one the drone shot last time. I like the way the word dicking around them a bit. Yep, okay, sure. Um, is there any th projects you would like me to assist with? I mean, I'm fine. I'm just putting a turret on top of my ship. That's it. And I'm, well, I'm happy to manually sort out the ammo for it because I think it's going to be too much of a faff. We're not going to be able to it? attack right away anyway because there's a storm well, because coming we'll need in. 10 minutes of mic. Uh... Well, that too, but also because there's a storm coming in. Um, That's a lot of uh, cargo space you've got on this thing. Me? Or someone else? Me? Oh, I'll see Who are you talking to? Yeah. Okay. Uh, I might adjust this, actually. I don't think I need the two targets. The problem with tinkering is that once one starts tinkering... The tinkering does kind of never end. It's a bit like Factorio in that respect. Remember what the button to change the size on a on a thing I'm placing is? The same press button that you times. press to get it, yeah. Ah, got it. Ah, uh, there we go, thank you. Yes, that makes more What's sense. the limit on a small uh, conveyor port again? And does the big ammo fit through it? Uh, I think yes, the big ammo, so I believe the ammo does. Yeah, it must do, because otherwise yeah. the turrets wouldn't have small ports on them, would they? Fair. Okay. That makes things a little bit easier. I, I am disappointed so, that you you revealed my shooting at <laughs> Mike in a way that even Mike understood, yeah. Oh, well, I should have been more subtle. Yes. I mean, arguably, you should have been more subtle to start I with. was incredibly subtle, given that I was standing behind a... Uh, uh, for ship shooting, yeah, I was yeah. hiding behind something. I mean, I I, I my... didn't know until and you told me. My beacon was off. Oh. And my beacon was off. <laughs> or not, I... you know, my uh, whatever it is is off. Yeah, I didn't know until you told me. Uh, but that's because I wasn't there at the time. But it was pretty obvious listening back to the recordings because of the the different weapons. Well, I mean, sounds. come on, I did. Oh, there's a drone ship coming and all that business, you know, which I thought was. Uh, yeah, yeah, I thought that was bit corny. Of a... Bit of a ham actor. <laughs> Because I'm using a ham radio. Okay, well, the beacon's working. I will just go and control the beacon. The deacon is working. You know what? I think the um, the big rover really needs. What are we? I don't know what we're calling the big rover. Whatever, what it really needs. Zorro. It's called Zorro. Zorro. Why? Why not? Well, because he's going to carve big zeds in the ground of Mars with it. Yep. If you like. Um, I would rather not because that would probably involve wrecking it. And believe it or not, I do have a moderate amount of care for our vehicles. Well, you didn't last week. I mean, I I think is the main point here. Well, last week, I did not exhibit a great deal of care for our vehicles. The only damage was unintentional. This week, I, I, I have even learned how one throttles a wheel so it cannot go above a certain speed. 
can one throttle oneself? <laughs> Mike, <laughs> would you like to uh, find out? Uh, okay, Rev, I'm just going to come and have a quick sh shifty at your drone so I can see how many, how wide the gap needs to be. So that's one, two, three, four, five large blocks wide. Probably should be six. It is quite big, Frank. I would have built it a bit differently if I had started from scratch, but, you know, we, we are where we are. And then from front to back, it's one... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven front to back. Okay. Trinity Porter should not be underestimated. The, the top deck of the rover could be wider than the bottom deck, right? Sure. Totally, 100% wider. Well, no, I, I would make it less than 100% wider. But I think this is possibly a good idea. This thing is really asymmetrical. <laughs> Who built this? What is this? Trinity Porter. Oh. Uh, ah, to which we know the answer. I thought it was the Mars Thing Imaging Corporation. Mm-hmm. Oops, sorry, RCX. Oh. Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> you just kind of nudged me I, off when I, I was using that. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Yeah, you've been watching the video, says. <laughs> Alas, this is why did I, I feel? I feel I am going to have six. to build my vehicle outside. Who oh, knows? So would you? Ah, hello. That's better. I can hear you now. Yay! Hello. What ho? You were stunned uh, by the Watson hose. Yeah, my the sound. My headphones are being annoying. Yeah, your microphone's also being annoying. <laughs> yeah, um, I'm. I was in the process of eating. I had dinner slightly late. Ah. I will destroy Red Dwarf if you eat into the microphone, Mike. <laughs> I would be more tolerant if it's, I didn't live with it. It strikes me that there was a, a mistake made in this game because Mike's built the attack rover and called it Red Dwarf, but surely he should have built a mining ship. Oh. Oh, are you building a new thing, Mr. Heaney? I am. I, I am intending to create a vehicle which has the ability, which will have... um The ability to cloud men's minds. Yeah. <laughs> See, to get some more jetpack fuel, which will have the ability mm. to function either way up by yes. having... A, a good shout, given your, your track record. Mm -hmm. that, that um, is... By track record, I mean... Off track record. Indeed. <laughs> that is actually trickier than you might think, though. Don't you have to just reverse steering on some of the wheels or, and so forth? Mm. And can you not change the key binding on certain wheels? Oh. It's Philip going to have to start as a, uh, like, sir, as someone we left for dead previously and has survived by eating their companions. But the, uh... I mean, I think that depends on where he manages to spawn. If he does the same thing Suz did and, like, spawn in an inconvenient place just because it's, like, the first thing that gets offered. Sorry. Um, maybe. Oh, okay. It's okay. Yeah. It's not like Mr. Heaney crashed the uh, our main vehicle at the time in uh, retrieving it or anything like that. <laughs> I feel that is Mr. Heaney's fault, though. <laughs> is it, though? I think, I think you're assigning blame where no blame is to be assigned. <laughs> Well, I think I'm assigning blame where blame is to be assigned. What did the crash investigator say after the incident? <laughs> <laughs> well, I did send Dan some video, so, um... Yeah. Hey, 
So, how long is your thing again? Freezing. <laughs> it's got the connector in the middle, and it's one, two, it wants, well, one, two. It's not very in the middle, the connector. Landing gear's in the middle, and one, because two, I wanted three. to keep the mass up. So, three at the back and then two at the front, is that right? No, okay. three at the back and three so... at the front. No, it is in the middle. Okay. No way is the connector in the middle. The landing gear is in the middle. Right, I'm going to oh. put another seat on Trinity um, Porter just in case anyone wants to ride with me. Oh, uh, I don't think, think anybody will want to ride with you. And, uh, Are you I sure? Are you sure that you don't want to ride in his silver machine because you're because you're just feeling mean? But it's not a silver machine. It's like maybe that dark was his blue error. and grey. I have yet to add any power source to it, but are we doing that after I've... Would you like me to drop a battery on you, or...? I mean, I'd prefer to be dropped on the vehicle, but yeah, thank you for the offer. Uh, hang on. Oh, this this is not um, a valid connector. So... I know, I'm still beating oh, it. I'm, oh, I'm sorry, building sorry, it, and you told me to get out the way. Oh, sorry, I didn't. I thought you'd finish, sorry. <laughs> no, um, no, no, I had not. Being stupid. It... No, 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 uh, no. Handbrake. Yes, 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 handbrake. yes, 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 yes. Uh, does the Trinity Porter actually... N oh, yes, it does. Okay. Guns? What were you going to ask? Does it actually require the conveyor to be sticking out by a block rather than embedded into conveyor. the floor? And it does because the landing gear is too low. Well, it's it's not too low. It is a picking things oh, option. Oh, CX. Sorry, I'm so sorry. All right. <laughs> they kind of, like, swing out from the... Uh... Ah, energy. Right, speaking of energy... I think I have to go fulfill my daily needs. You're talking about uh, <laughs> about your energy or the beer? Does, does RTX have a say in this? The beer. <laughs> you see, that doesn't work if you're not actually familiar with the mod. I know, but the viewers will be. Uh... There's a mod called Sorry. Daily Needs, which makes you have to eat and drink. Ah, I see. Which means, of course, that you have to make food and water as well. So I'm surprised none of the physically minded people in this group have yet commented on the fact that uh, you can turn ice into hydrogen and oxygen I've, I've, using I've, energy. Yeah. But then you, there are also hydrogen engines which let you burn the hydrogen to get energy. Sure. And it gets you more energy than it takes to turn the uh, ice into hydrogen. I mean, I I mean you have not commented on this because I didn't realise this was the case. <laughs> and I uh, also, I, I, also, balance. also, I feel that the um, game is obviously not physically accurate anyway. What? what because are you Mike was able to competently build and manoeuvre a vehicle. Well, I mean, also the fact <laughs> I mean, that you could, for example, true. Well, also, also the fact that you were able to, for instance, have a vehicle that set itself rotating with a piston. Wow. <laughs> well, oh, that's yes, like, well, you built a that's, perpetual motion machine, didn't you? Know, yes, that's, like... that's the little known clang force. <laughs> uh, you know what I need? I need more catwalks. On the catwalk. Do your little turn on the catwalk, baby. Yeah. Oh man, I haven't heard that for years. No, I've still got no small steel tubes, though. Well, when was the last time you were on the catwalk? <laughs> Baby. <laughs> Mike, when you want to okay, test, you, you reverse into it. Okay, <laughs> you want to test? <laughs> can you reverse into it? Okay. Now I, I, don't, in. I don't know what the context <laughs> I, I'm is. I'm pretty but sure he can reverse into it, whatever it is. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Do you mean the connector oh, that, 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 that there's a giant vehicle in the way? Or not in the way no, no, the lower no, one. The other connector that doesn't have a giant vehicle in the way of it. Ah! <laughs> what a good noise! What a good noise! Hold on, I have to come and see it this was now. A great noise. I've got what, what did you reverse into? Oh, the I, I almost, I almost hit, got, the, got it connected, but I just reversed a bit. I was not quite right. Okay. Yeah. Uh, 
Is this you building this RCX? What? This amazing thing with all the yeah. grinders on. Uh, why There's is this the, not the connected? Desert bus 2, yes. Does it go the yellow desert bus 2. Uh -huh. I hope you took a blueprint to the Desert Bus 1. Uh, mm, maybe. Ah, uh, okay, I see. I'm just very slightly off. This is quite difficult. Yeah, yeah, you know definitely. you were supposed to be coming to help me with the Zorro. Uh, well... The Zorro was like... meant to be our rover. Maybe uh, it goes no, yellow. Oh, okay. sorry. Go oh, I'm sorry, did I just run you over? No, 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 no. I walked in front of a vehicle. It's fine. It's my fault. Okay. <laughs> yeah, a vehicle that is reversing at that. So. Yeah. Sorry. In fact, you did what? run her over, is what you're saying. <laughs> well, yeah, but to be fair, I right. can't see. I'm to be looking. Fair. I'm. I'm looking behind me. Like I can't. No way way of knowing. You were driving without due care and attention, is what you're saying. <laughs> Two, <laughs> three, and then probably the four. Highway code. Four. Okay. This is going to be uh, quite tall. This this little hangar thing. Two. Three. Four. Yeah. Well, yeah. We, we must be ready for some action now because I've had a chance to repaint my entire ship whilst you guys have been doing whatever you're doing. I'm trying to park. Well, you could. Help. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. There we go. Mike, you good? You good? No, I don't. Okay, want to. now I need to put the handbrake on so it actually. Oh. Okay. Oh, I need 30 of those. Good, good. Ah, uh, there we are. Oh, no, that doesn't look right. That doesn't look connected. Is that connected? Well, it's usually white. That's yellow. Yeah, it's got a yellow light. It does the yellow. If it's yellow, it's not connected. Yellow, yellow oh, okay. means it's ready to lock. You have to press uh, okay. the control on your hot bar to make uh, it connect. Okay. So I need I need a lock option. Okay. Yes. You probably want switch lock because you will also want to unlock it later when you feel courageous. Yeah. <laughs> uh, okay, I see. So that's why it didn't work. Um, I didn't unset the locker. There we go. Uh, it's now locked in place. Good. And now let's repair the damage from the inevitable crashes. Oh no, there are no damage, surprising. What? Sparks to fly. Make a note of that for later, shall we? <laughs> Can we quote It's a like red letter day. So, this looks like it's locked. We're sending um, this footage to your insurers, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> I, I mean, they have my, my insurance history, so... <laughs> <laughs> okay, I could do with some large-scale welding. Sure. Do you want me to stick one in front of the Trinity Mathmo? Trinity Mathmo? Trinity, Trinity Mathmo. Trinity Mathmo. Trinity Mathmo. Well, I was thinking maybe you could bring the Trinity Porter over here to... Um, I mean, it doesn't have any cargo, does it? It does have cargo. No. Well, it doesn't have any cargo in it, you mean, at the moment. What, what do you well, want no, in it? Well, no, I mean it? cargo space. Well, it would have to have a bunch of steel plates in it in order to weld up these... Uh, um, and it needs to be connected to large connector, though, in order to do that. Mm, yes, because a welder only has a large connector anyway. Well, but if we stick a, a welder on the bottom with large connect, mm, we could do it with the back side of the Trinity. See, this is what this is what I was thinking in terms of something I didn't actually design this thing, so it's not very good from that perspective. <laughs> oh, he's got the excuses um, going already. No, no, I said this at the start. This was the excuses started earlier. Uh, hang on, so I just. So I'll actually, fly I over, but worries. I don't have large cargo. You're you right could just to. fly over and park. That would at least test out the size and shape of this hangar. Sure. Do you want me to approach from this side? Just uh, do you want me to uh -huh. like right. Yes? Dan? Yep, and go through the obvious gap. Uh, hang on. i change my camera okay. to get that. Yeah. I see, I see. Yep. I can't bloody... No, I guess what I want. There should be more than enough space for you to yep. get through. I believe there is clearance. Oh, I'll get finger down again. I, I can say about. I believe there is clearance here. That's not right. That's right. I mean, there's more no. space than the front of your hangar. It is a bit tight on the wings, is it not? But uh, sure, it's a bit tight on the right hand side there. The the ablative uh, armor on the wings. Yes. Yes, we just don't and ablate then... it while you're parking. Oh well, shit! I fell off. Uh, you're uh, about half a block, half a block yeah, so too far back. You need to go forward. I'm just looking for my camera. There it is. Cool. You're locked. Uh, why is it not letting me place these? Yeah, if you want to stick a container and a welder on the front of this, then we can do some welding. Shall I, shall I do that? Um, As I say, it, it, is, it is a bit shit that I why, haven't why got large connector grid on it. On the but, rear, uh, you've already got medium cargos here. Yeah, I can. That's fine. Let's Energy do that then. Low. 
and just take off do these two angles. Do we have, at present, any lar- oh, do we have any large batteries I am able to use? Um, have a look behind Ooh, my yes. hangar, which is the battery storage. I hit something. I, I didn't get a word of that. Have I just hit something, or has the uh, server just crashed? Oh, oh really? Uh, I am still- Um, seems to be still no, working I mean, for me. Still seems to be working for me, yeah. There's like it's... two here, right in the middle of the open space. Okay, good suggestion, Dan. Yes. They are connected nice. together, so you'd have to have two batteries. Oh, also, ah, oh, shit, I'm running out of hydrogen. Yeah, like also, pay your there's bus. one on this wrecked vehicle here. Ah. Uh, I think yes, you mean the wrecked Big Daddy. I think you can Ooh, finally yeah. salvage that now. Yeah, it's like Daddy. a reactor down here. Big Daddy wow. is dead. Oh. Ah. Uh, so that frees up the That's name. Weird. For there's just like a large grid small reactor like where are you in the in the ground here oh stay right. still what was the key what was the key stay for me again yep <laughs> uh shift control p i believe right. i might be wrong uh, uh, is your paint. connector like actually connected to your cargo system no i told i, I oh. said it's not how i designed it but oh anyway. well hold on oh well in that case how am i going to put them in to the cargo can't, can't you reach behind the welders there no oh there's Can a you... small port behind the welders i there see there's definitely a small port to the side there's a small port to the side just stay still no that i want these out and then uh, uh i'm just try, trying to get not to get toasted by your uh, reactors they're there, not, they're by not, your thrusters. Uh, well, okay, the, the welders aren't on yet, so... Yeah, but the thrusters will still hurt me. Right, there you go. Not much, though. Uh, you don't worry about doing the floor of the hangar, because I'm not going to have this like this. I'm okay. going to change these two interior plates, I think. Uh, save that. Oh, actually, no, I've just realised I could do this whole thing a bit shorter. Ah. Uh, if I embed it into the floor and then use catwalks. So, oh, they are on. There we go. I'll oh, get a better view. Uh, someone's oh my unknown signal just like dropped on the base. <laughs> That's oh, convenient. Okay. I'm just not going to stand in this hangar while you're welding, just to be on the safe side. Oh come on, Mike, would you like to come and just stand on my welder? For no. A <laughs> <laughs> and then I think I'll change the floor of it into interior plates because they're a lot lighter. This is a really ugly colour you've got me welding on here. It's kind of sand coloured. It's the same colour as Mars. It's it's uh, camouflage. Yeah, so that's not really going to help us much, is it? I mean, it's going to... It makes no yeah. difference to the AI. I don't think the AI, yeah, I don't think the AI is going to notice, and it's definitely not helpful for us. Oh, uh, well, you know, that's that's like the camouflage working if the AI is not going to notice. <laughs> well, RCX, you're going full uh, of Robot these... Wars in that vehicle, aren't you? Oh, don't mention Robot Wars. <laughs> that's that, uh, it's not going to end well. Wow, that's quite quite a quite a container you're building on the back there. Mm -hmm. Well, it has to contain Rev's greatness, so. Uh... Oh no! What happened there? <laughs> uh. What? This vehicle at the front of the base is now smoking is, for some reason. Is not for turning. Do you mean that Mike's either. vehicle? Oh yeah. Uh, the... No, big silver one. I'm having connection oh, problems again. Uh, so, so, so don't worry, yeah, that's Big Daddy, we're dismantling Yeah, we, we've decided... Oh, okay, okay, never mind. It was destroyed by a drone falling on it, so we gave up. Also, what the smeg happened to the front of the... Uh, oh my god. The first hangar. Near where Mike's... Stink testing? Did, did Mike um, happen it, to it? No, I, I think mean, we just exit... Isn't this where... Um, isn't that where one of the guns opened fire? On, oh, that might be it then. Yeah, the, so, some of the blocks yes, that caved in. I... I do you remember I went and retrieved a battery from somewhere else, and then uh, I believe RCX blew it up the moment it arrived. <laughs> did I connect up the front cargo with the back cargo? I can't. No, I don't think I did. 
Oh, it didn't? No. Well, these two cargoes are right next to each other, aren't they? Yeah. Yes. As I say, the ship, when I found it, oh. had a lot of cargo containers, but they're not connected to anything, so it's a bit... Are the left and right cargoes not connected together? Uh, they are as of about five minutes ago. Okay. But th these but ones on the front aren't. only the left and right aren't. rear cargo. The uh -huh. front cargo is an anomaly. There's medical components in here. Ah! You're running me yeah, over. So <laughs> those are the ones I found, remember? My uh, mm, unknown signal. I feel like maybe we should put them more sec somewhere more secure than in your flying thing. This is thing. extremely secure, I believe, is what you're trying to say. RCX, can I have some design advice? Yeah. I would like to put the spotlights on uh, rotors or hinges so that they uh -huh. can uh, angle down towards the ground. <laughs> yeah. So I was thinking two options. One is where they are. Just put a hinge going straight up. Dan, I'm, I'm out of materials again, by the way. Oh, well, I haven't got any more materials to give you. Hold on. Oh. Welding in a dust storm, what could go wrong? <laughs> I guess Ooh, the the insane crazy vehicle is now work existent. <laughs> so, uh, which of our vehicles are armed, and are we are we ready yet for the challenge of uh, attacking? Um, the we are almost ready. Um... Ah, that's quite brisk. Me? Yeah. No, I'm okay. I know what I'm doing. Oh, bugger, Mike. I'm sorry. Uh, what? The front, the front bit came off. The PNS uh, bit. That's uh, right. I'll, oh, I'll sort that out. I did it. I turned my vehicle over and it kept going. Can you see her, though? <laughs> Maniac. Uh, I'm a bit jaunty. I mean, you have a gyro, right? The well, anti that, but jaunty as device. As I said, the, the Q&E, it doesn't really work that well. Yeah, I've had the same thing on, uh, on things I've built lately. I wonder if it's some bug that they've got at the moment. Oh, metal grid convoy. That sounds useful. Yeah, we should probably go try and get that. Yeah, you want to go yeah. get that? Okay. Motor shipment. That's oh, what the fuck? Motor is also good. Ah, yeah. So the metal grid is leaving that Duke Rock ground base. I mean, it'll be a while before it's out of range of the ground base anyway, so... We can oh, give okay. it a minute. Okay, I will uh, come and give you some more steel then, Rev. Uh, am I going to be able to paint these? Um... Uh, no. Well, that was quite unequivocal. <laughs> no, you may not paint them. <laughs> Mike, I also cannot seem to paint the uh, okay, that's blocks for. Okay. Yeah, I'm sorry. I we'll have to sort that out then. Hang on. I don't know why. Why can neither of us paint the blocks? I have finished, Dan Chan. I'm going to go and park. Wait, I'll just open my tunnel. You can park inside. Uh, how much power have you got on your grid, though? Uh, I'm tempted to go and recharge on my grid for a bit more power. Well, three large grid batteries. Oh yeah, I won't be offended if you do. Why can't I stay upright? <laughs> Inebriation. It's, yeah. So many you know what you said about last like session? And how just we spent the whole time building and yeah. nobody yeah, was ever ready I mean, to attack anything. I'm nearly yeah. ready. That was also uh, true of all of last session. <laughs> <laughs> I, I am ready, ready, but yeah, sure. Sorry, I've, I've lost you guys. I, where are you? Uh, I'm in the middle of the open space. No, no, I was in. I'm. Uh, I'll fly back towards your ship. Oh, you should you're be able quite to high see up. The desert plus, uh, oh, right, I'm right above you. That's why I yeah. can't see. You. <laughs> Good work, man. I'm literally just doing circles above everyone. Thank you. Where are they? <laughs> well, uh, you know you're doing how you Be careful you know. how fast you come down. Yeah, I know. Oh, you I do know. have it's quite okay. a lot of lift, actually. That's good. I, I added some more lift to do some more heavy lifting. 
Yeah. Well, because there were lots of heavy rovers to uh, recover last session. Indeed. <laughs> now that our vehicles are nearly ready, we'll be attacking again as soon as the dust storm clears. We'll also be joined by another survivor with a grudge against the evil G Corp. I hope you can join us for that next time. The problem with tinkering is that once one starts tinkering, the tinkering does kind of never end. It's a bit like Factorio in that respect. <laughs>